Hey, welcome everyone. It's Irvin here, uh, aka Team with Irvin. Welcome to another week. This is my very, very first week teaching you with my brand new multiple time frame system. So if you want to see tomorrow full analysis with my brand new multiple uh, time frame system, make sure you hit the bell notification below because things are about to get fired. So remember, all you got to do is what? You better make sure you hit that bell notification. All right. That's all you have to do. So today we are going to be doing our pre week analysis for uh, July 13 to the 17th. And remember, guys, please, the, uh, the month of July is a very slow month. So don't expect the market to be doing crazy movement. It's not going to happen. OK, please just need to make sure you know that. And the next slide that I need to show you guys is very important. Because everybody need to know, I'm not your financial advisor. This is the forex disclaimer. I'm not your financial advisor, neither your tax advisor. If you are looking for a professional advisor, you need to look somewhere else. I'm just here, like you, looking at the mark, at the chart, analyzing the chart, see what how many pips we're gonna be getting this, especially this coming week, uh, July 13th to the 17th. But once again, I'm not your financial advisor. I'm just another fellow trader looking to squeeze hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pips out of the market. So please, 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 guys, pay attention. Hey, guys, please download this app. It's very important, in my opinion. The FX Hour, it will tell you that uh, what's going on with the London session, the New York, even Frankfurt. That a lot of people don't even talk about it. Tokyo and Sydney. And the next app is, is a must. You, you, you can, you can, you have to have it. It's my FXR. That's why we usually analyze the market. But whatever news the market is going to throw to us, this is it. All right. So I just want you to make sure you have that on your hands because it's very, very important to be honest. All right. So uh, we are, like I say, you know, this is our brand new, brand new pre week analysis using our my brand new multiple time frame system how to trade profit using the higher time frame so we are, i'm going to be showing you tips and tricks and this is the pre-week 13 to the 17 all right so here is some pairs and hopefully everything makes sense i will describe what is mine and what is not mine all right where you can get it as well I just want you to understand where is that thing available. All right. So let's go there. Make sure you hit that bell notification because it's very, very important. All right. So where is my chart? So let me bring my chart. There it is. There is my chart. So first of all, first, let me go ahead and kind of give you how I'm going to be doing things. I have come up with a, a new multiple time frame system where I usually are going to be trading only the higher time frame, which is going to be the four hours, the daily, the weekly, and the monthly. Here it is. It's ready built in on MT4. It's not like I'm going to make it up or I'm going to be telling you things that don't, it's not going to happen. No. Everything is here. This is the only higher time frame. That's what is called multiple time frames. All right. So, but another thing that I have come up, I don't want you to do all this hard work and hard lifting yourself. So I have come up with the most obvious, most obvious um, support and resistance. So I don't want you to do that. So if you see here, one touch here, another here, another here. And there's many in there. Look at here. Another one here. Another one here. Another one here. Here. Plenty here. Another one here. Three here. Four, five, six. Six in there. Same thing happens in here. Area attach. Area attach. Area attach. Look. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at this beautiful thing. That's what I come up. I don't want you to be drawing all this. Support and resistance. Same thing happens over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful. Look at this. One, two. Look at here. One, 
So I don't want you to do all this li uh, heavy lifting. So I have come up with my own multiple time frame uh, indicator, which is going to make your life easier and everything. And here also I have the uh, moving average. This moving average will trigger exactly where the things are about to change and go on the other side. Remember, this is not a perfect and hundred percent indicator. They say, yes, the market is going to give you now. No, my job is to at least collect 75% of my winning ratio and be in that level in the category. So at least I have a, a, a good track of winning ratio instead of just guessing what the market is gonna do. So that is what is gonna be happening from now on, guys. Uh, this is how I'm gonna do it. Uh, it took me a long time to put it together. I wanted to show it to the world and I'm so excited. If you have not seen the video, the introduction of this one, please do so go in there. But uh, the good thing about this guy is it's very, very unique. I put on each time frame on the four hours, I put an arrow, which is gonna be the red in line, right? Let me write it down so you will see it. And then we go to, uh, then we go to, uh, what's his name to, uh, to the uh, analysis, right? So my four hours is equal to uh, red and line. My one day equal to white. My one week equal to, I'm sorry, it, it's not white here, it's yellow. Someone had, look at that, someone just correct me, Urban, it, it was not that fine. Let me write, let me do it again because hey, the more I do it, the better off I get, right? So my four hours is the red and line. My one day equal to yellow, right? My one week equal to white. And my monthly equal to blue, right? So, but I, what I have come up in here is, look at here, it's, it's so damn easy, guys. This is gonna blow your mind, to be honest. So in here, I have the four hours, daily, weekly, and monthly. Every, all this, all what I'm keep, what I'm showing you here, guys, is built in inside of NT4. It's not like I'm, I copy someone. It's not that way. It's already built in. All I put, all I did was I grab all those settings, put them into an indicator, and now I'm going to make my life a lot easier. If you pay attention here, this is the four hours. This is the, uh, uh, the weekly, right? Here's the yellow. Yellow, now now we have it in magenta. Magenta is this uh, magic, uh, Tim with Irving magic arrow, uh, entry arrow, which is here it is. And then the monthly is here as well. Look at that. One, two, three, four. Look at how simple it is. So it's everything but colors in, in arrow. See, this four hours. Four hours daily, four hours daily, four hours daily, four hours, four hours, four hours, four hours, four hours, four hours, four hours. So I don't want you to be drawing all the support and resistance. I already come up. Look at look at my uh Tingle Urban magic arrow. When the ma magic arrow come in, it tell you, hey, it triggered a signal and say, hey, we're going down. Look at that. Boom, market that came down. Then another signal come in and said, Irvin, we're going up. Boom, we went back up. And then I said, Irvin, we're coming down. Boom, we're coming down. That then simple, guys. Hope you like this. I, but I just wanted to show you what is mine and what is not, right? Because there are some indicators that are free. And I'm just going to grab them because, I mean, they are inside of the uh, of your uh, NT4 into the uh, market, uh, on the marketplace. So all you got to do is go to view terminal type, look for the marketplace and type, for instance, the, uh, see that this, uh, the goal, it has goal here, right? So this one, you can find it. it this, uh, uh, indicator here, if you type it in the marketplace is called, um, what is, what is called? Let me, let me check it. So you can see it, right? So, cause I want to be clean, clean, honest with you, right? This is called uh auto no no watermark this is the watermark that is already for free inside of the uh um, of the uh mt4 right so it's not like a copy anyone no it's not it's free the next one 
is that is free as well is this uh, um, Fibonacci I did a video and I asked everyone hey what do you think about the Fibonacci here's the setting of the Fibonacci if you go here on about it tell you here out of Fibonacci retracement here's the website of where is this free Fibonacci is located you can click on that on the uh, on the Fibonacci and it tell you that it belongs to trader tools that which is free it goes out to the world so as soon as I click in there, it will bring me to their website. So don't say that I'm, I'm copying and doing another stuff. No, sir. It's everything is free. And I want to be clean, honest with you and tell you, hey, where it is, it's free. Look, at there's plenty, plenty uh, information in there. You can get it for free. But all I'm going to hear is, look at that. Here's the Fibonacci, right? So it's pretty neat. Uh, hopefully you like it. And... Uh, but I'm gonna be showing you on, on this one. And uh, if you guys want me to change the color of the Fibonacci, let me know. But I, I just wanna give you the most basic and truthful uh, information. But this is not my, it's free. It's free to the world. Go and get it if you wanna get it, if you don't have it. But let's go ahead and start with work. So we're gonna go ahead and start with our first uh, trade of the day. So this is, we're gonna start with AUD Canadian. I always say guys my favorite time frame is four hours that is my always be my favorite favorite time frame like I said four hours daily weekly and monthly pay attention all this I'm gonna be teaching was building on mt4 all you gotta do is learn how you gonna be using my brand new multiple time frame system all right so in here this is what I have for this for this coming week, right? So what this coming week, what I'm expecting the market is to drop, to drop and retest our mid zero to our 23 Fibonacci line. It's gonna come back and retest all these small uh, support and resistance in this area, and then the market is gonna give us a small pullback, retesting all this area here. Look at one touch: two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9 10 11 12 13 all that 13 so we're looking for next 14 touches in there and then because it's gonna happen here to be honest look at that boom and then from there market will continues a bearish so i'm looking on this particular aud canadian i'm looking for a bearish position all right you have any question any question guys because this is it so i just want to give you the best thing ever and it's, I mean, I'm giving you for free. So the benefit of this moving average guy is, look at here, before I, I forget. When the signal come in and tell us, hey Irving, there's a sell here. So if you line up all the way to the bottom, look, it match. Signal, signal, boom, it turns red. Look at here, it gave us a, a another signal as a buy. It tells us in there is a buy. And then signal, and it went up, look, signal, signal, Boom, it went back up. Look at here, another signal here. Boom, signal, signal, boom, it came down. Damn, guys, I'm telling you, man, this is the most amazing, amazing things that I have put together, and I love it, I love it. And I, we just use it multiple higher time frame. That's all we use it, all right? All right, let's go to the next pair. Uh, we are gonna go ahead and analyze GBP uh, USD. Pay attention, Irving loves the larger time frame. Here's another signal. Signal is telling us, oh, we are coming down. All right, perfect that. Look at here, signal come in. Let me put this uh, vertical line. All right, so let me turn this on white. I like it white. Cause it's easy to uh, see it. And let's see if we do this one. Yeah, that's fine. Look at that. Look, I'm doing everything live with you guys. I'm here live. So pay attention. And uh, guys, do me a favor. If you are finding value already, let me know. This is the only way. Look, I come up all this for you guys because I wanted to make you guys a profitable trader. I did this all this for you guys. Look at that. All I want looking here as a favor is give me the thumbs up. Be honest with me. Let me know, hey, Irving, can you work on this? Do this a little bit different? Let me know. And also, please, you know, you here with me. I'm here live. Comment below. Let me know. What comments do you have? Do you really like what you've seen? You want to see more? Because tomorrow I'm going to be doing the full 
uh, week analysis, right? So we are using our multiple higher time frame. Okay, so all this belongs to me. And one thing that I forgot to show you guys before we move on is here, here's the information of my moving average. This is my, right? It's, it's like I say, I grab all this inside of an MP4. All I did is I put it together. It took me forever. But here it is. If you click here on the info, it will take you to my YouTube channel. Here is my telegram and my favorite phrase, hundreds and hundreds of what? What do you think I'm here for, guys? Ha <laughs> I'm here for hundreds of pips. This is the moving average, right? And the next one, uh, the one that I created for the support and resistance, here it is. Also, it's mine. It gave you mine. Look, it's on the about. It will tell you, it's, it will take you straight up to my YouTube channel. Here's my telegram and hundreds and hundreds of what? Let me drink some, some coffee, guys, because you guys need to know what we're here for. What we're here for. And hundreds of pips. All right, cool. All right, what we're looking for, let's get to business now. Now that I introduced you all the tools. So the only thing that is not mine here is the, uh, um, the watermark, which is free. Or the marketplace and the Fibonacci that is not free as I mean it's free as well, but the rest the support and resistance is already built in on MT4. All I did is I put all those settings together into a indicator, and now we have a magic entry as well, magic error. So what we're looking for here in this particular pair here for this week, remember we are trading the week of a, uh, July 13 to the 17th. We are looking for a drop down, a bearish market retesting our 50 Fibonacci line. From then the market is going to do a small pullback, retesting our 23 to our zero Fibonacci line, which is going to retest all this high. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And this is going to be the 11 touch. From there, I'm hoping market will continue as bearish. So I want you to come back with me on Wednesday. Uh, uh, I'm going to do this on Wednesday at 5 p.m. Eastern time. And then we're going to analyze this together. All right. So I just want you to make sure you come back on Wednesday and let me know if you did find value of this. Let's go to the next one. The next one that I have here is the Euro USD. Euro USD, I have our... Uh, I have a uh, a drop here that is what the market is gonna do in this particular trade here is we're looking uh, we're looking for a drop. Pay attention here, all these touches here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that's why I'm looking for this one to be in a sell position. Anyway, the sell position is telling me here the market is coming, is about to come down. Look at that. You are seeing it here. You are live with me. So what the market is going to do in this particular area here, market will do a drop all the way, retesting our 38.2 Fibonacci line. From that particular area, the market will do a small pullback, retesting our 23 Fibonacci line then we'll continue as bearish market. Do you guys have any question? If so, go ahead and put it below. Let me change this arrow. I don't even know why I select magenta. Let me do it on, let's do it on white. I think it's better. Any question guys? Let me, let me go ahead and answer some of your questions before I move on to the next slide. All right, all right. All right. All right, let's go to the next one. We are going to analyze gold in this particular pair here. So let me delete this here. Oops. Bear with me. All right, here's gold. This is, pay attention to what gold is doing, guys. Gold gave us, based on the four hours, daily, weekly, and monthly. Look at all this. It broke our monthly uh, uh, time frame, right? So here's the monthly. Here's the four hours. Here's the uh, uh, weekly, and it broke. And the uh, week, the uh, daily went back up, up, all the way to the high, right? So now we have four hours, daily, and here and weekly all line up. So that's where the trigger happens in this particular area. Now we're getting a gorgeous uh, drop down on gold. 
pay attention. I don't know what software you guys are using, whatever you are using. Go ahead and analyze it with my uh, higher time frame, multiple uh, time frames, right? Then this is a damn pretty simple thing. Look at here, guys. If you pay attention and you drop down here, it's another. Anyway, my signal, my, my indicator gave me a signal saying the market is a sell. Look at that. Boom, 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 boom. And it turned red. That's exactly, exactly what the market is doing. So you are here watching it live. So it's not like I'm making it up, nothing like that. So right here, now we're looking for a drop to retest our 23.6 Fibonacci line. From that particular area, we are looking for a small retracement to retest this previous highs here, which is going to be one two three four five we're looking for our six touch here which the market will continue as bearish market this is me and remember it, it, this is what i have for this coming week we are going to be trading the week of uh july 13 to the 17th then we are going to be looking for a drop retesting our 38.2 fibonacci line all right so uh make sure guys you are gonna be watching our tomorrow full week analysis it's gonna be explosive we are gonna be talking only with our uh multiple higher time frames all right so looking forward to see you guys tomorrow if you guys don't have any question it's time for me to do another business and i will see you tomorrow all right take care guys bye bye uh, bear with me let me select this one all right guys take care Bear with me, bear with me. Let me bring this up here. Let me delete this. There you go. Alright, take care guys. Okay.